Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And yes, Hard Candy did go ahead and collaborate with the Girl Scouts of America to go ahead and do face makeup. And they did three different palettes. One's based on Thin Mints. One's based on the uh, caramel, um, the caramels that come in the purple box and the coconut caramels. That's what they're called. And the third one is uh, based on the tree foils or tree foils and I've done one video on the tree foil palette and this is my uh, video on the salted caramel coconut palette so um, let's go ahead and get into it and um, let's see what the Girl Scouts are doing for makeup lately and uh, we'll go ahead and get started I know yes I match today I got the I, I, yeah, I got the cookies. Samoas. Okay, they're called Samoas. The coconut caramel ones to go with the look that I have on today. So, yes, I am all Girl Scout outed. I am Girl Scout outfitted. I am Girl Scout everything. And I hope they, they make a gazillion dollars off of this clap. So, to get started, I started off with the Glow Oil by Super Goop with SPF 50 of it. Or SPF 50. Then I did go ahead and pick up the Glamouflage Full Coverage Foundation by Our Hard Candy. And this one is in buff. It's what I have on my face right now. And um, I think that it worked pretty well. It's actually oil free and has vitamin E, has a really fast dry down, which is really nice. And so um, I did go ahead and use LYS Triple Fix with it as far as my concealer today. And then I did go ahead and use the Usual Suspects Essence Thick and Wow and Caramel Blonde uh, for my brows there. As far as what I did for the lips, and this is one of the new Hard Candy uh, Girl Scout lipsticks. This one is Coconut Caramel. It's what I have on right now, so it's pretty pretty, and a lot of a lot of natural shine to this one, and really nice packaging. And then um, I did also pick up the Hard Candy Insta Pout, and this one is in uh, Sun Kissed. So that's what I have on as far as the lips go today. Oh. I forgot, I did put on the Shirin V Glow Serum Primer from Hard Candy as well. And this one has a really, um, it smells like sweet tarts. Gives you a little bit of glow and a little bit of color. Uh, since I'm so light, it almost gives me a little bit of bronze, but not really. But that's what I have on there. As far as bronzer and bronzing, I did go ahead and use Hard Candy Face Off. This is their bronzer and sweet tea. And this is their newer line. I uh, really like the packaging and being able to not waste product. And it's pretty, um, it stays cleaner this way. And so I kind of like this packaging a lot. And this is the sweet tea bronzer. Again, it's what I have on today. I did go ahead and mix my blushes. And all of these are liquids. Yeah, they're not even creams. They're all liquids liquids here. So um, I used Face Off again and uh, went ahead and mixed these two blushes together. This one is Be Real and um, Who Is She? So it's a uh, pink and a red and I just sort of mix them together to go ahead and get my look today. And then as far as what I did for the highlighter, again um, this is a girl's Girl Scout product, and this one is called uh, Tree Foils, and it is the highlighter, really pretty highlighter as well. I guess I could do, yeah, here's a swatch of it. It's a gold, but it has a little bit of peach in it, and comes off really pretty. Pretty, pretty. A lot of um, this it's a lot of pretty makeup and it's a big collection so uh, this is the actual palette that I used today again it's a hard candy it's called Caramel Queen Shadow Pad yeah talking today in me Caramel Queen Shadow Palette there we go so that's what I have on my eyes today 
and um, really pretty palette. These ones down here, these two are actually coming off as sort of a bronze and so it's really pretty. Um, as far as what I have on my eyes today, I did go ahead and put this in the crease. And then I put this one on the outer corner. I put, um, let's see, some of this right yeah, it's going to be right about there. So um, it's still on the outer corner officially. And then some of this a little bit closer in. Um, I did go ahead and put this color right on the middle of the lid. And then I went ahead and used this for my eyeliner underneath. And this pretty shade here I used from here to here and then from here to here. So um, I went ahead and used this as the inner corner highlight and right under the brow. And like I said, it's just a really pretty palette, this way that it turned out. And I'll get you a couple of swatches, and I'll be right back. Okay, so it's Adrian back again. I did go ahead and get some swatches here. So these are the colors, and um, a lot of really pretty 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 colors and what I'm noticing with these palettes is even though um, like this one has a lot of purples it has a lot of good everyday shades in it as well so um, yeah the uh, there are definitely it's a purple and bronze kind of palette to it it does have um, two browns in here and then uh, yeah it has uh, two browns, two bronzes, and then it looks like a champagne and uh, this middle shade, which is uh, gold. So really pretty, really pretty palette. I think it uh, works really pretty on the eyes. With all three of these palettes, I've been finding out that the color stories are pretty different from what I thought that they were going to be. And so I like the fact that they went ahead and added in a whole bunch of uh, shades for everyday wear in here. I think it's a good idea. It makes it a very useful as well as a very fun palette. So um, the other product that I'm using is I got the Hard Candy Girl Scout. This is their Indulgent Volumizing Mascara. So Indulgent Volumizing Mascara. So that's what I have on there. And like I said, this look just turned out fun. And um, yeah, I didn't think that I would be mixing purple and bronze, but I am, and it looks good, and I'm having fun. So I am really glad that I got to participate. Again, I hope that you make a gazillion dollars off of this collab with Hard Candy, and I hope that you guys learn a lot of good business uh, techniques and that you have just a plain good time doing it. So uh, that's my video, and I hope that y'all have a great day, and I'll see you later.